Hello everyone. Today we'll talk about how we can work with databases in Excel queue. So in this current example, we're going to perform connection with PostgreSQL database and see how we can fetch data from this database. So in this example, in the PostgreSQL database, we have a database named Sergio, which is hosted on this particular server and port. Our table is called product underscore product, which has two columns. One is name and the other is minimum variant price amount. The name contains the list of the products and the minimum variant price contains the price for each of these products. So let's see how we can fetch the price for say example, Lake Tunes product. So first and foremost, you need to connect to the Postgres database. So you say connect to PostgreSQL database. Now you need to specify the session name. So I say it is PostgreSQL demo. And then I specify the server name. which is 35.247.49.109 and then the port number which is 5432 and database name which is Sailor the username which is AQ tester and then the password Once you're done entering the password, let's now execute a database query. Simply type execute database query. And let's say we want to fetch the row which contains the product name as Lake Tunes. So we write a database query, so we select star from product underscore product which is the table name where name like and then we say Nicktoons so we have our query written which will take it from the current database and let's say the name of the query is get product details okay so now we have got the product details we don't need to capture this information anywhere after we have got the product details now what we want to do is to get the minimal variant price from this particular details so we say get database field value and then we select what is our query reference name which is get product details so we type that get product details hit enter row number say one for now which is the first row and then the column name where you want to get this price amount is minimum variant price amount so you type that minimal variant price amount okay now you are done now let's say we want to capture this just for verifying the results so we specify a local parameter we say product price okay and now we have captured this price just for our reference sake, let's just log this value out. So we say log, and we say info message, and we just print this particular value out. Okay, so this is what we're going to do a simple test where we have connected to the database, we have executed the database query, got the relevant details, and then we are fetching the particular column from the particular database table. So let's run this. 
So we don't have any browser involved here. So we just say no init required. And let's just run this and see how it works. So let the setup be in progress. So now your database is connected using the connect to PostgreSQL database. It has executed this particular query, which is to get the product information. And then it has pulled out the value from the PostgreSQL uh, database, which is the price, which is $8. So that's about it. Thank you.